Here's a video about how to wire this 5.8 gigahertz 200 milliwatt video system for FPV. I bought this from Foxtech FPV. It's also available from BEVRC and I think Hobby King has it in a few other places. But first I'm going to cover the receiver. This comes with two wires. The first one is a power cable and it came with a JST plug. I just connected a Dean's connector on here because that's how all my batteries are. The second plug has the video out. The yellow one is video and the white one has audio. I just need to get an RC adapter and I just hooked that to my monitor. Now this is the video transmitter. This first cable here on the bottom has the power and once again I just connected a Dean's connector on here just because that's how all my batteries are. So that's how they should be. And then this top plug right here, it, it came with the, uh, the red and the black reverse for me but this is the correct order for this plug. And then there are two other wires here on the bottom that have some audio channels. I just took those out. So these three wires I wired into a servo plug. And I had black, coarse moth black, red with red, and this yellow uh, wire from the transmitter goes to the white wire on here and that carries the video. And then to the camera I connected a wire that matches up like this so it goes black to black red to red and the white one over here goes to this yellow orange one on here and it just corresponds directly with these wires and this is the FH18C camera from Foxtech FPV uh, it's been good so far I'm excited to fly with it um, so the system's pretty easy to wire up and then so on your plane you just connect a battery on here just a, a uh, three cell lipo and you do the same here, three cell lipo on the receiver and then you're good to go. Let me know if you have any questions. I just wanted to add a quick note about how to switch these wires in this big connector. So this red and black one came reverse for me so I had to fix that. So I just took a ballpoint pen and pushed down in these little holes right here and here and you press down these tabs and the wires come out. And then I pulled out the wires and I pushed the tabs up into the position and just pushed them back into this plug and now those are fixed. So if your system comes like this, this is a quick easy fix for you.